Hello guys and welcome to a new episode of Mario's channel. As you all know, or you probably don't know actually, I like Arabic calligraphy. This is a name that I written in Arabic. It reads from right to left. It says Salma S L M Y or A uh, Salma. So I was wondering maybe I could should take this to the next level. And this is what I came up with. This is a pyrography set, which means it writes on wood. I just bought it a few days ago. It's from Presiva. Here it is. And it costs around 25 pounds from Amazon. If you want the link, I'll put it down below. Obviously, nothing is sponsored. So let's try it together and see what we can do with this Perit Perceiver. Now, apart from my belly, you'll be able to notice the contents of this bag. We've got the thing, the actual, I don't know what they call them, I don't know the specific names, but we're gonna call it the burner. We have the burner here, and here we have the bits, the bits and bobs. We've got loads of them. I don't know which each one of them does, but that's the beauty of this video, is we're gonna be discovering them together, pyrography. Now I'm just gonna pick a random one. Let's pick this one here, the little pointy one. So this is the one that I picked. I guess you screw it in. I have no idea. As I said, we're just discovering this together. So here we go, we're just basically screwing this up here. Pyrography is ready. Now let's connect this to the let's connect this to the internet and by that I mean to the let's connect this to the electricity and see how many times can we burn ourselves. Here we go. I'm just gonna remove this. Actually, we might as well keep that in there and remove this one. I spent about 10 minutes trying to put the, this in the plug, then I realized that this is on Ah, now remember, when you are doing pyrography, always remove your plastic from your cable because you can't pull the plug when there is a plastic on it. Let's try that again. That's better. Okay, we've got light. I don't know if you can see this, but this is actually lit now. Let me just put the... Okay, there is no light and now it's lit. There's a lamp. Still, you might not be able to see it because there's a lot of light. Anyway, it's lit now. Now, I think this is where you rest this. So, I believe now you have a better view of what's going on. I believe this is where you rest your pyrography set on this little device. I believe you have to put water in here. So, I might as well put some water. I don't know if I should be putting water or I shouldn't, but I'm going to put water. I'm going to put Potter, nevertheless, here's a bit of water, I can actually smell the burning, I don't know if that's a good sign or a bad sign, but there's a strong smell of burning. Now, they've given us some hearts, there are some hearts, I assume they're made of wood, if I'm not mistaken, so, here's a wooden heart. It's made of wood. The smell is intense. I'm just gonna pop a window open because the smell is intense. There's like smell of thing. something is burning. I assume this is where you uh, adjust the temperature. We've got um, different temperatures. I don't know. I'm just gonna put it on the first setting on hot here. In the middle, right in the middle. Now let's have a look. Let's see what we can do. Let me just focus a little bit more. Here we go. I hope you can see this now. Here we go, let's start. And we've got this to rest it. Right. What should we say? Let's say hello, the usual. Here we go. Okay. It's not exactly what I had in mind. It doesn't do much. Am I doing this wrong? I think I'm doing this wrong. No, nothing is happening. Oh, this is going to take ages. 
This is gonna take ages. Is this is this what I'm meant to be doing? It's gonna take a while. It took me about 20 seconds to do this line. I have a feeling that I might not be doing this correctly. Let's raise the temperature a little bit more. Let's put it all the way up to what is that? 200, 300 degrees? Wow, 300 degrees. Now you don't want to be touching that with your bare hands, I can tell you that. This thing is going to burn you forever. You're going to have a permanent burn in your skin. Okay, let's try now. Yeah, it's getting a little bit better. A little bit better. Okay, let me rest on this thing. Which I think is where you're meant to be resting it. Now let's see what other... Oh. Okay, so we have loads and loads of these little things different shapes and I don't know what the hell is that it's like um, how do you explain that what is that anyway let's continue with our pyrography and see what we can do all right hopefully now it's heated up a little bit more so we can get a better a better burn burn I say burn Nah, still rubbish. I don't know. I'm not. Know. Am I doing this correctly? If that is true, then I'll be spending ages trying to write something because this is taking a while. Now you have to go back and forth on that letter, unless you have to go very slowly on it. I'm, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, okay. I'm getting the hang of it now. Okay. Here is the H. So we've managed to write like carve or burn an H into our wooden heart. Now let's see if we can put an E in there. E. Nah. I don't think I'm doing this correctly because it's taking hours and hours. You can hardly even see it. There must be another way of doing this because uh, this is taking a long time. I'm doing this correctly. I don't think people spend three hours writing a letter. Even if I write very slowly, something doesn't make sense. It just takes ages. Am I meant to be like perpendicular on it or something? That doesn't seem feasible. Does anyone do pyrography here that can explain what we are doing wrong? Because if that is what pyrography is, then I'm getting bored already, to be honest. No offense, but it's not something that I would have the patience to do. I can hardly see the E. And I've been doing it for like a minute now. And it's only a small, small, small letter. I'm just going to read the instructions and see what we are doing wrong because this can't be right. Am I meant to push something? Anyway, I'll be back. Don't go anywhere. Stay with me. Stay focused. Six and a half hours later. This was written by someone who's never been to school or English is not their first language or their, or their second language. It's probably their fourth language. It says here and I'm reading what it says. Choose one wood burning tips on. No, doesn't make any sense whatsoever. If someone can translate this for me. Choose one wood burning tips on. Choose one wood burning tips on. Choose one wood burning tips on. So from what I gathered, there's something called soldiering, soldiering the wood, and there's something called burning the wood, burning. So, apparently, this is soldering. I've chosen the soldering bit. This is the soldering bit. I don't know why I'm soldering. But, if you want to burn the wood, you have to choose one of them babes. Because, as it says here in the manual, choose one wood, burning tips on choose one wood, Burning tips and choose one wood. Burning tips. So, if anyone understood what that means, 
I think it means choose one wood burning tips on. Let's choose this one. This one is nice. I like this one. I have to go again so that it focuses on it. Alright, so let's try and screw it before it burns me. Slowly. Go, 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 go. Slowly and steady. Okay. On off switch. So now I've turned it on. And we go round two. Please stay focused. Actually, sorry, it's not as fast at all. It's not doing anything. I'll demonstrate by holding this here and by poking a little I'm touching it see nothing happens it is on but nothing is happening let me try again anything is happening guys there is nothing happening here come on just do anything just make a burn or something Okay, I'm gonna hold it for about as long as it takes and I'm gonna fast forward this. Let's put a watch. Ah oh, yeah, here's my clock. So my clock just turned 3021. Let's see how long it's gonna take for it to burn. Now I'm fast forwarding this. Fast forward, fast forward. I'm leaving it on one surface, I'm not moving it from that surface. Okay, so it's been about a minute now. It's 13.22. And this is all it manages to do. It's a bit better than that. But for this small area to take a minute, if you want to write the whole name here, it's going to take you about from 10 to 20 minutes. Am I doing this right? Am I meant to be doing that? rubbish anyway thank you guys for watching this episode I hope you like it this is pyrography don't forget to put the thermal iron sleeve back and choose one wood burning tips on just so that you know what you're doing now look at this look at this picture isn't that exaggerated a little bit just don't you think that this is exaggerated a little bit I'm not getting that at all if I was getting that, I'd be very happy. But I'm not getting that. I'm not getting anything near them. This is what I'm getting. It's the worst thing I've seen. So unless I'm doing something wrong, please let me know. Comments down below. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next epi. If you like this epi and you'd like to watch more, please consider subscribing. Or consider sharing, like, leave a comment. I'll see you next time. Peace.